Hey everybody, welcome to another Two Minute Tuesday. Today we're talking about the power of the pinkies and how much they play a role in your grip strength and grip pressure when shooting a pistol. So I make it no secret on the channel that I am not the best shooter. I started at the bottom and I am a little bit above the bottom. I consider myself an advanced beginner, but after taking these weekend classes with Rick from Achilles Heel Tactical, I feel that once I refine the skills that I learned and utilize the knowledge that he brought forth, I feel that I'll be closer to that intermediate level. The first thing that we started with was grip pressure and grip strength, something that I was totally lacking. And what he had us do was break off into ones and twos. My partner and I, using unloaded pistols, um, we would extend out with our dominant hand and they would come by and press on the underside of the firearm. And if you did not have good, pro good strength with your pinky, they would just rise, they would, it would just rise and you would be like, man. So then once you apply proper pressure with your pinky, it's amazing to see how solid, how locked in that firearm is. And then when you take your support hand and do the other hand and how much pressure you apply with your pinkies, you are gonna instantly improve your uh, recoil, mitigate your recoil so that you can have better follow-up shots. There were some people that were struggling with this and watching them shoot and then Rick would come over and he would have them grip it with their dominant hand and he would come in and be their support hand. Watching them shoot infinitely better with two people, two hands on one gun was astonishing. And it really was amazing how much, pre how much these pinkies play a role to mitigate your recoil. So, you know, when you have proper pinky pressure, you're gonna be able to stay on target and shoot better shots and shoot better follow-up shots. I posted three shorts over the weekend. Uh, one was yesterday, Monday, and that was of Rick taking five shots as fast as he could at a target from five yards. This was part of the dope drill, which I'll get into in another video. But it was amazing to see how flat his firearm stayed while he was shooting those shots. And the first bullet casing hit the ground after the fifth shot was taken because his fingers fast and it stayed flat. He had uh, instant reacquisition of target. The other short that I posted was on Saturday and that was of me shooting using these skills that I learned and drawing from the holster, prepping the trigger, and firing on the steel from 25 yards. I went three for three and I was very very happy with myself. So it's easier to do with a friend, pinky pressure, have them use an unloaded firearm, have them press from the underside and see what kind of pinky pressure you are providing to your gun to help you mitigate that recoil and make you a better shooter. That's gonna do it for the Two Minute Tuesday. Like and subscribe, leave a comment in the comment section below. We'll see you in the next video.